Hi and welcome to 50 feet below. Today we're going to review the Aqualung Phaser. This is a brand new fin by Aqualung of course. And at first glance it looks like any other pedal fin. Um, what Aqualung did was introduce a new technology called the Wave Rip technology. And what it seems to do is load up your power in the sides and release it just at the right time. So let's dive in. The phaser is available in five colors. First of all, plain black. Then you got white blue, white pink, white hot lime and black hot lime. Um, they all look flashy and really nice, but we're a little bit worried when you take a white version that it's getting dirty really quick. Um, there are three sizes available, small, medium and large, so nothing special there. And the fin is around $190 on Amazon. And when you compare that to other fins, this seems fair. The fin is made out of three materials, two kinds of rubber, one in the foot pocket, which is really smooth, um, one in the fin, in the center of the fin, and on the side there is plastic to create more stiffness inside the fin. The fins come with an elastic heel strap, which feels a little bit stiff when you get it right out of the box, but they do loosen up after a few dives, which makes downing of the fin quite easy. The phaser is designed to do a normal pedal kick, because then the wave rip technology works the best. Um, we tried a frog kick, but this felt a little bit weird to me to do, so better stick to the normal pedal kick. Once swimming along with the phaser, you will notice a small push being given by the fin. Um, it's a small push, but it's noticeable, so it's really the wave grip technology doing their work. Um, the foot pocket is quite comfortable, so you'll be comfortable for more than an hour. You don't feel any discomfort there, and these fins will do very well when you swim, by instance, against the current. Aqualung did a great job developing the phaser fin. And they're actually great paddle fins, especially for your home turf. If you want to bring these fins along on your travels, they're 2.2 pounds each, so per fin. Um, so that's quite heavy, and that's because of the heavy material used in the fin. This makes the build quality great, but not so great for traveling. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and leave a like on this video. Of course, only if you like it. We post new videos weekly. So see you on the next one.